All right, y'all. Sorry for the unexpected uh, change of wardrobe real fast, but we got the Magic City Classic with Alabama A&M versus Alabama State. Now, let's uh, go ahead and get this started, man. Uh, I'll talk as the video goes along. Uh, shout out to everybody, man, who's been supporting, man. Shout out to everybody who is here with us still. Uh, let me put my man down a little bit. All right, so I saw the headline that... Um, that Alabama State fired their head coach. So I assume this game didn't end in Alabama State winning this game. I assume. Because I don't really see too many people firing their head coaches the same day that the team wins. Never see that. So we're going to see how, how it all went down. I mean, I hope it wasn't too bad to where they had to fire him. But... Man, Alabama a and coming off of their um, coming off their bye week, and let me just say this too, man. Um, you know, Alabama a and has what? They got Alabama State. I think they still got to play. They still got to play Texas Southern. Who else they got to play still? They got to play Southern still. I mean, they don't have a. Have they played Mississippi Valley State? Nope. They have not played Valley State yet. Um, yeah, so I think they have Southern. They have Valley State. I forget who else. Cause, but, man, uh, that, was, that wasn't even a good boots punt. That wasn't even a good punt. That was, that was bad. But, man, I just hope, look, for Akil Glass's sake and his draft stock, I hope he, like, destroyed this team. I hope he put up at least 30 points. I hope. But but I'm also going to say this, too, man. I think his defense let him down this year. I think his, his defense really let him down this year. Like, they're, you know, like, for the sake of the team, and, it, and I'm going to be honest with you. I kind of saw this season coming when I saw that Tuskegee put up 35 on him. That right, that right, that right there is when I knew trouble is going to lie ahead. And I thought that they would beat Grandma State fairly easy. And they didn't. Matter of fact, Akil Glass probably had the worst game of his college career at against Gremlin. It was it was it was sad to see. Damn near, it was sad to see. You know what I'm saying? Like you got four interceptions. He had three. I think he had three interceptions in the first half. Like it, it was just, it was just absolutely terrible, and I honestly didn't know what to think about after that because then you were about to go up against Jackson State next, and stupid me, the stupid person in me, I thought that Alabama a and would actually win that game. I was dumb. I was absolutely dumb. I was really dumb because I said that look. You can't lose two games in the low to freshman quarterbacks. That's what I said. The stupid person in me, I actually said that uh, Alabama A&M was going to beat Jackson State. I was dumb. I'm sorry. I was absolutely stupid for that. But I thought that Akil Glass would have a much better game. I thought that they can compete with Jackson State defense, not knowing damn well I didn't know that Alabama A&M would give up 60. They gave up 60 to a team who was on ooh. They gave up 60 to a team that averaged less than 20 points a game. They gave up 60 points. You know what I'm saying? So I, I didn't see that coming. I also didn't see them losing to Florida A&M. Oh, well, I'm not going to lie. I did see him losing to Florida A&M, but I didn't see them. I, I didn't see them giving up an 18-point lead 
in the second half and losing. I didn't see that happening. You know what I'm saying? So, oh, damn. Damn, boy. Boy. Oh, damn. Boy, he done, he damn near took his helmet off. But he probably had, okay, he's still, he's still in the game. I thought they were going to put him on the sideline. But yeah, man, yeah, Alabama and them defense really let them down this year. Because their offense was still explosive, even still. Like, their offense could put up, mm, get hit. Their offense could put up points in a hurry. But, you know, like, I didn't really see anything wrong with them giving up 27 to Bethune Cookman. I ain't seen anything wrong with that. But when I saw that they gave up 35 points to Tuskegee, a Division II team that's not even going to the Sayat Championship, they're not going nowhere. They're not going absolutely nowhere. And they lost to that team. Nah, bro. Oh, well, they gave up 35 points to that team. Yeah, I, I saw I saw bad things coming. I mean, I, I and I me, I didn't see anything wrong with them. You know, looking back on the first game of the season, I didn't see anything wrong with them giving up 44 points to South Carolina State. Touchdown, D. D. Anderson. Shut up, D. Anderson. But yeah. I didn't see anything wrong with them giving up 44 points to South Carolina State. There's nothing wrong with that because South Carolina State is an explosive team. Matter of fact, they're one of the more explosive teams in the MEAC between them, Howard, and Norfolk State. Between those three teams, they can put up points at any moment. But yeah, man, Alabama a and defense really let them down this year. It was a downfall. It was definitely worse than what it was in the spring. So far, definitely worse. Good job defensively. Third and long. No, but I mean, look. Mm, get hit. Uh, Akil Glass can say that he led his team to their first right championship in 15 years. He can say that though. He can say that. He does have a conference championship under his belt. He does have that. Whether it was whether it was a short season or not, short season, whatever. But he got one, and that and he can he can be he can be accomplished for that. He be praised for that. But going to the Magic City Classic, man. You know, I did a video. Actually, did a video of um, you know, of the Magic City Classic two months ago. Mm, open. Damn, and you threw him? Yeah, I know I knew you mad you gave up that. You had to throw him. <laughs> mm, right? Mm, okay. Yes, sir. I forgot what I was saying. We yeah, had the Magic City Classic, man. One of the best classics in HBCU football. Ooh, touchdown. Need him. Uh oh, seven seven. Uh oh, seven seven. We need six of those. Okay, what are we doing to kill? Mm. You know what I found out? Me doing the video, right? So I did a video of all the like all of the celebrity. Like I did the best highlights. Mm. I did the best highlights of Magic City Classic. Hit in the history or whatever. On top of the celebrities who went to the Magic City, like I see, like yeah, Master P, LL Cool J, mm. Ice Cube, bro. Freaking Ice Cube came to the Magic City Classic one year, bro. Steve Harvey, freaking. Dog, he had a um. I forget who was like you had a. I think Charles Barkley went to the Magic City Classic one year. Like, bro, I'm like you had so, but you had so many celebrities that went to the Magic City Classic. It was crazy, like ridiculous. I'm like, I'm like, well, that's how you knew, bro. Master, matter of fact, with and with Master P, he said that was his first time ever going to. In HBCU homecoming, 
and he had the best time of his life. So I always thought that was dope. I thought that was dope. But yeah, oh yeah, I, I've been talking way too much, but let's get to the game. I talk way too much. Let's get to the game. Oh, come on. Mm, quarterback on the roof. Come on. Nettles. Regular, regular 4 3. Mm, good catch. Amon said, You could put up points on, on, on Alabama. AM. You put up points on AM. Yeah, man. Alabama AM. They have a good. Mm. Yeah, man. Come on, man. Come on. Ooh. At least, at least you do that good. Good throw. Hey, that was a bad throw, but then you made up for it with a good throw. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh. I don't know why you threw that. I don't know where you were looking at with that one. You have four people around the person you were throwing to. You have four people over there. I ain't seen Jerry and Moore yet. Come on. I haven't seen Jerry and Moore yet. Come on. Corey, Gary Quoles. Gary Quoles. Not for nothing. I think Gary Quoles could play in the league, too. Oh, uh, uh, come on. I mean, look, he... He tripped him up, though. He helped trip him up. But yeah, man, I, I look. I just, look. I think Gary Cole can play in the league. I think Ibrahim can play in the league, too. Mm. Mm. I think, matter of fact, bro, to be real, I think Javier Moore can play in the league, too. Matter of fact, Picking up the blitz here. Mm. Oh, good catch. Yep. Ibrahim for the touchdown. For the touchdown. The All American. That boy been coming alive this year, man. I think he's probably top five in reception this year. In the swap. In yardage. And touchdowns. Mmm. Bad throw. They're hoping that if they get back, come on. Mm. And the Hornets. Yikes. Yikes. It not look good. It don't look good. Go. The draw to Ezra mm, get hit. and Gray, who's get hit. stopped up. Yeah, I don't, yeah. I'm with you on the breathing technique and everything else, but. I'm going uh, I'm to feel. Who's going to be the quarter? Okay, there goes J.B. Moore. There goes J.B. Moore. It's his first time seeing him. Mm. Gary Coles. I think J.B. Moore can get drafted this year. I think they're going to they're gonna make good on HBCU players this year or next year. They're going to have so many players drafted. I have at least... I have at least 10 players getting drafted. At least 10 players. But I'm going to do it. I already have an idea of who I think will be drafted. I already have an idea. Mm, good catch. Good throw. But yeah, I already have an idea of who I believe which, H which HBCU players will get drafted. And not everybody is in the sweat. Trying to keep mm. at all yeah, not yeah, not not everybody is in the sweat. Matter of fact, I got some D two guys in mind. Cause guess it, check this out. Oh, uh oh, oh, okay, go then, go then. Ooh, nice. Oh, what's the flag? Oh, what's the flag for? Come on, let it count. Come on, it gotta count. It gotta count. It gotta count. They called that. The defensive back was running around him in circles. Oh, it didn't count. Damn, it didn't count. Oh, no, oh, no, my. Yeah, I, I was about to say. Mm, I was about to say the receiver over there was open, but I seen the safety roll over at the last minute. Glass going one-on-one again with Anderson. 
I don't know why. Uh, now nah, that was good coverage. That was good lockups. Gary Cole. Oh, touchdown. Give it to him. Give it to him. Give it to him. Need it. Need him. Need it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? Uh oh. Go. Pow. Get out of there. Okay. Yeah. This is definitely being one of the uh one of the classics I would love to attend to. Mm, okay. Okay. Do run. Okay, get, getting your two minute offense then. Getting your two minute offense then. Mm, no sir. Okay. Okay, and then what a second. I see you. You're in a four two. Oh, he caught it. Okay. I thought he's gonna pick it. Oh, I know he's mad. I know he's mad. Ah, he always picked it off. Oh man, you were just a tad bit late. A tad bit late. You could have picked it off. You should have closed it in more. Okay. You finish score. Okay. I hope you all score before the half. You got oh, man. Yep, man. Can right there. Yep. Good, yep, good decision. That was a good decision. One-on-one -on -one coverage on the bottom. Yep, there you go. Okay. That was, yeah, was easy, though. That was easy. Yep. They gave it to him. They didn't give it to him. Nah, they gave it to him. Nah, don't do that. Uh, oh, he didn't get the ball back. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. What's going to happen at the start of the half? At the start of the half? Is what we doing? Start of the half? Oh, go out of there. At the start of the half? Is what we doing? Okay, okay. Okay. At the start of the half? Okay, I see you. Okay. This is a good crease right here. You'll see him. Return. Mmm. At the start of the half? Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. Let's go out of the middle of the We're going to tie the game up. We finna tie the game up or what? What's up? What are we doing? Oh, come on. Mm. Okay. Come on. Sorry about that. Uh. Mm. Mm, nothing. They sniffed out that screen from jump. They sniffed that out from jump. Nowhere. Mm, come on. Third down. Uh, good catch. Like it's fourth, yeah, fourth, okay, fourth down. Oh, he ain't going for it. They, they said we need a touchdown. They said we need a touchdown. We going for it. Ain't no field goals over here. First down. They said ain't no field goals over here. We got to tie the game up. They said they don't believe in their defense because we got to score. Oh, there you go. Mm, touchdown. Need, a, need six of those. We need six of those. We need six of those. There we go. Yeah, touchdown. Okay, tie game. Okay, a Q. Nothing. Oh, that's how you start. That's how you start it off. That's how you start it off. Okay. I see you, ASU. Mmm, good move. Good move. Good move. Okay. Good move. What we doing then? Oh, yeah, that's a pass interference. You damn near tackled his eye before the ball got there. My goodness. Come on. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Get out of there. Mm. Okay. What we doing then? What we doing then? Come on. Oh, easy, easy. That was easy. That was easy. You need all six of those, number six. You need all six of those, six. You need all six of those, six. Ah. Uh, you didn't even speed turn, corner. You didn't even speed turn. Uh-oh. Oh, 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 oh. Damn. Damn, son. Damn, son. Damn. The ball back. Let's see. They look like it's 10. Yeah. 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 Oh, damn. 
gets the contact. Boy! Soft Tackle his ass. You don't let no quarterback do that to y'all. Okay. Mm, come here. And that's Hilaire. Hilaire who caught the touchdown there. Okay. Trust your second. Man. Blitz him. Try and get a big There's so many class bro, there's so many classics I want to go to. I just I, I can't do it all in one year. Cause I, I live I live so far up north. I can't even do oh no. Move the power then. Move the power then. Move the power then. Okay. Move the power then. Okay. But yeah, man. It, but there's so many classics I want to go to. I'm not going to be able to do it all in one year, but I live so far up north. I don't want to be paying airplane tickets out the ass just to go to classic games. But I definitely plan on moving back to the south, man. I definitely want to move back to the south. I would have bust, boy. I don't care. Look, I don't care if he's going on that play at night. You see a kill glass coming to block you, you knock his ass out. You gotta, boy. You can't let no quarterback come block you, bro. I don't care if it's going the other way, bro. You got a chance to hit the quarterback, you knock his ass out. And, and when I mean knock it out, I don't mean like literally like knock him out the game, bro. I mean like blast him on the floor or something, like rough him up a little bit. Like I don't mean knock him out the game. Uh oh, he's got to sell that. Oh, that look ugly. That look ugly. Is this where this game gets ugly? Is this where this part get ugly? Is this why the head coach gets fired? Oh uh, no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, is this where it gets ugly? Is this where it gets ugly? Oh man, I hope this is not where it gets ugly at. I want, I want to be competitive still, I want to be competitive still. No man. Oh, come on. And a kill guys is an NFL prospect. You know, because if y'all look, if y'all look at the video that I did of him like two, three weeks, like two weeks ago. Oh, good dive. Two, like two weeks ago. His draft stock won't drop as far. Like, I, in the video, I said it, it, it hasn't dropped. Not yet. I'm pretty sure since it's bye week, I'm pretty sure it has. But it ain't falling as far as people say it has. Because, and it's only because of the quarterback class that he's in. Like, he possibly is in one of the worst quarterback classes that I've seen in, 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 in quite some time. Like, in quite some time, I ain't seen a quarterback class this bad in a while. I'll be honest with you. But I think they have that, uh, that Malik kid from Liberty, from Liberty, probably as the best quarterback coming out the drag. But they don't have him getting drafted until like I think past I think past like number ten or something. Like they only have ooh, they only have bro, they only have two quarterbacks coming out the first round. They only have two. That lets me know a lot. Like, that lets me know a whole lot, bro. Like, that's absolutely crazy. Mm. You know, I know that the Jets drafted their quarterback, but... Eh, I think Miami may be looking for... Oh, okay. I think Miami is probably looking for a quarterback. I think the AFC North is, is is good. Well, Ben Roethlisberger may be out the door soon, so I think the Steelers may be looking for one. Mm. I think Houston may be looking for one because, but Deshaun Watson not playing. He's not playing for Houston no more, but they, they need to they need to cut him. Like they need to trade him. They need to trade him or cut him or something. But Houston gonna need a quarterback. Nixon in the slot. He already has a 
Uh, oh, let's see who walked in the quarterback. Um, I think the Detroit Lions may be looking for one. I I don't know. Mm. Um, I don't know. Um, I don't know too many other teams who may need one. Like off the top of my head, yeah. Okay, touchdown. But I don't know off the top of my head who need a quarterback. But I mean, but maybe that's why they don't have nobody. They don't have nothing but two quarterbacks coming out the first round. Okay. But Gary Coles, though, I think Gary Coles may be drafted this year. I think J.B. Moore could be drafted this year. I think Ibrahim, I think he's a I think, wait, is he a sophomore or junior? I'm not sure. If he's a sophomore, I mean, whether he's a sophomore or junior, I'm pretty sure next year. Let me see. I don't think next year he'll have as much of a productive year only because he'll be playing with a new quarterback. I'm not really sure. I don't know. Check it out. Mm. Mm, back though. But yeah, man, like, I think Ibrahim may be one of the best 10 receivers next year. Oh, come on. Good move, boy. Yes, sir. Mm, a wide open. <laughs> wide open. How you get so wide open? How you get so wide open? Four minutes left. Look, y'all still got time. Y'all got three timeouts left. Y'all still have time. For the Hornets. Yep. You gonna throw it? Mm, I thought you gonna throw it. He should have threw it away. You ain't had nothing. Nettles with time continuing to look. Go, 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 go. He's not able to get too like a horse collar, but whatever. Like a horse collar, but whatever. Go for it. You going for it? Jeremiah Hickson, who's been a big play. He's right down at the markers and it's broken up. But a marker comes out. Oh okay. Oh man, okay. We still got time. Got tip. Oh, come on. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Got to score here. Y'all got to score here. Come on. Hey, look. They put up 28 points. So the offense did their part. The offense did their job. I mean, look. The offense put up points. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Damn. 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 Third. Third down. Third down. Why you throw so short? Why you throw so short? It was third and thirteen. Come on. Boom. He dropped it. Yep, it's over. We can cut it off right here. Oh man. All right. Well. A little mistake. I guess that's why he got fired. I don't know, but uh, sorry for that. Um, well, maybe this is the reason why, but shout out to Alabama and m You guys got to win. So congrats, man, but you have a long stretch ahead of y'all. Well, a good, a nice little, look, I'm done doubting Mississippi Valley State. I'm done doubting them. But, oh, man. Y'all got y'all got Mississippi Valley State still, and y'all still got Southern. So those last two teams, y'all better y'all better be prepared for them. And I hope y'all ready. <laughs> but shout out to y'all, man. <laughs>